The incident happened within Wamala Policing Region, Kalisizo, where a security guard of Neptune Security Company shot and injured a Congolese national identified as Bonane. The incident has attracted investigations and queries on the training mode for security guards. The altercation occurred when Bonane assaulted the security guard and attempted to disarm him. In response, uh, the guard shoots him in the knee and after the incident it is when police comes in and transports the injured uh, to hospital. Police have called upon the public to restrain from provoking people with guns. You find individuals tackling armed personnel. Now this is not only reckless, it is risky. You can lose life the reasons as to which you are confronting the armed personnel can be addressed without necessarily going for the confrontation. Over the weekend, police carried out operations in different hotspots within Kampala Metropolitan, in areas of Luzira and Chisenyi, where several criminal gangs were neutralized and 12 suspects arrested. Communities have uh, uh, leadership structures. They have security committees, but they have an LOC structure which can be tapped into so that we collaborate with the police and ensure that these criminal gangs are dealt with. Security intelligence organs have cautioned the public not to move with bulk cash as criminals are at lookouts to take such people as viable targets. Police advise the public to utilize available and emerging digital platforms to carry out necessary transactions. There are very many electronic arrangements that can, uh, can have payment or bulk payments without necessarily coming into contact with the big cash or cash sums. Uh, two, you can hire security. In Kampala, police arrested Mayanja Hassan for assaulting and robbing a university female student. It is alleged that Hassan and his accomplices still on the run ambushed a Victoria University female student, Arinaitwe Macklin, and robbed her valuables. Mayanja was apprehended and his apprehension uh, led uh, to additional um, arrests. He was also found in possession of a hammer and the stolen items. Police intend to use information from Hassan to apprehend his accomplices. Patricia Nandago and Rogers Kumagum for UBC.